A new million dollar investment will treat stormwater at the site of the new Burlington High School and Tech Center campus, minimizing the impacts of runoff into nearby waters like Lake Champlain. Here's NBC5's Jackson Stover. The new Burlington High School and Tech Center project has been in the making for over two years now. The final beam of the school's frame was added in October. It's a time when even when we can't agree on some uh, basic uh, priorities, um, we can use federal dollars to really make life better for people back in our districts. Vermont Representative Becca Ballant was at the site on Monday, presenting a $1.2 million investment to treat stormwater on site to minimize the impacts of runoff to surface waters. Whenever we have the opportunity, we want to um, slow spread out and sink that stormwater right at the source so it doesn't have the opportunity to gain momentum and you know, uh, enter our, our water bodies untreated. Scientists like Matthew Vaughn from the Lake Champlain Basin Program working harder than ever to keep harmful pollutants out of Vermont's waterways so people can enjoy them all year long. And you can see that we've made these great strides towards creating uh, a much uh, cleaner and friendlier place, but we still have work to do. And so the way to see that is to kind of get down here and literally get your hands dirty. <laughs> and, and jump in. <laughs> and jump in. One, two, three, two, three, let's go. Let's go. Eric Schonstrom is a professor at Champlain College. Monday's class assignment was to take an icy dip into the lake. Part of his job is to help educate the next generation about the benefits of healthy waters in Vermont. And as a South Burlington resident himself, is doing his small part in preserving the future of the state that he loves. You know, you kind of get a personal attachment to it and, and you, you, you really want to protect it. You want to sort of be a part of, of what keeps it healthy. And then ultimately, once it passes through the pond... Representative Ballant believes that this project will be a game changer for the community once it wraps construction. I think people are going to look at buildings differently after this is completed. At least I hope so. That was Jackson Stover reporting.